Hi, I'm John Storms, and today we are going to focus on the Falcon F48 V4 Pixel Controller, specifically on the onboard pixel output ports. But before we get into that, please give the channel a subscribe, give the video a like. That helps the algorithm so other people can find our videos. Thank you. We're going through the hardware setup for setting up pixels off of the uh, Falcon F48 V4. So the pixel ports are these four ports. Uh, it's a little different than the Falcon F16 in that the uh, Phoenix connectors, those green guys, are three pin connectors instead of four pin connectors. But really, three pins is what you need for almost any pixel. Uh, and of course these are WS2811 compatible, that just means that's the chipset they use. So the black wire is ground, or V-, minus. the yellow is data, and the red wire is V+, plus for voltage. Okay, um, and so we have them wired up in the Phoenix connectors, and then I have X-Connect female uh, pigtails coming out of those, and then I have those connected to the lights. And I have put 200 pebble... Uh, seed or fairy pixels, whatever you want to call them, on each of those four ports. So that's a total of 800 pixels in that little pile there. Okay. Um, and as far as wiring it up, that's that's all it's involved. And of course, it's pulling its power from the Meanwell power supply. Then, just for grins, I have a uh, differential board plugged into port 45 to 48 okay and this wire runs over to the input port of this falcon srx1 v5 okay and here i also have four pixel output ports now the reason i do this is because i want to illustrate something on the um, F48 configuration page, when we configure these pixel ports, they are mirrored on this differential output port, right? So these will always do the same thing as those, okay? So while you have these four ports, it's kind of reusing this. So it's not that you got, you know, an extra bank of four ports of pixels to use it's just a duplicate of this so whatever gets sent here gets sent there now in some situations that might be what you want to do you know maybe you got two trees and you want them to do exactly the same thing but they're kind of separated by some distance that's a great option otherwise you might use one or the other it really depends what you're looking for now we are logged into the falcon f48 v4 via its web interface so I'm on the status tab, and right now I have the board configuration set up to eight smart receiver chains. So if we look at the documentation, which I have right here, that means that these eight ports are active and the middle four are not. That's what they call 32 port mode. So I go back to my configuration and I go to output settings, pixel. So what I'm interested in doing is setting up the four pixel ports the four pixel ports are represented by the last four uh, port numbers. So on my board, this is actually, you know, higher than this. But since I'm in this mode, right, the eight smart receiver mode, uh, those four ports are represented as these last four. Okay. Now, if I had a differential chain set up on that, you know, where I actually had a chain of things, then this would be duplicate with 29A, 30A, 31A, and so on. Anyhow, but we're not set up like that. So we're going to set this up. It's already set up. Well, I'm not going to deny you the experience of setting it up. All right, so I go over to here, set this up for 200. I hit Shift F3, and it sets it up as 200 pixels the rest of the way down. Okay. Over here, I want to set it to 30%, Shift F3, and it sets it up as 30% for the rest of the way down. Okay, now I've only set up these four ports once. Okay, so I save this. 
I go to test and I'm going to run those last four quarts. Okay, and now I enable my color wash and boom, see that? The, they are mirrored. Whatever these pixels do on this port is being mirrored on this port as well, right? Which is really this port of four. So it's not that it's an additional four ports. It's a it's that you can mirror this and this together. See? And they do exactly the same thing. So it works. Um, what's nice for me right now in this configuration where I'm testing a whole bunch of pixels, I don't care that they do the same thing because I want them to do the same thing as far as my burn-in testing. So works out perfect for me. That's another 800 pixels I can add to the pile, which by the way, this is 7,200 pixels total, which is a record for me currently. We'll see. Tomorrow might be more. But this is demonstrating using the onboard pixel ports, pixel output ports on the Falcon F48 V4.